hang on. If I if I just stay here, are crabs going to kill this man? Oh no, Illy is going to save him from crabs. You got a little something there, dude. <laughs> All right. Slow down. Explain yourself. No time to talk. Snitch or double cross me, and I'll kill you. I mean it. Okay. Jeez, man, he means it. Shit, I'm going slow as hell. Why? What did he, what did you give me? What did you give me? Oh God. All right. <clears throat> I'm just gonna grab this root. What did this guy give me? Some kind of heavy ass armor? Oh god, a dwarven shield of waning fire. He stole that from the crabs? What the fuck? Okay. I think he died, Ilya! I think he just died! <laughs> When we had last left the last dragonborn, they were up by Winterhold Way, where they were to find a translator for Gallus's freaky cool journal that was encoded in what appeared to be, yes, the Falmer tongue, an ancient language belonging to, you guessed it, the Falmer, <laughs> who pretty much weren't around anymore. Or except for the fact that they totally were, but were really not interested in doing any kind of translation. However, up there in Winterhold area land, Enthir, after receiving a cool dope staff, or something like that, was able to help out the Dragonborn and Carlia, giving them a lead on someone who did perhaps know the Falmer language, the same person who probably taught Gallus as he penned the words into his journal. It was Calselmo, all the way across Skyrim land, in the grand city of Markarth. And there also did they get some stuff for Onman's am amulet from Enthir, but completely forgot about that. <laughs> However, now it was not the time for amulets. No, it was the time to begin a trek all the way to the furthest western reaches of Skyrim. Yes, through Falkreath, and all the way to... Markarth. This is the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Welcome back, and you'll see we also look very different. We're totally equipped in a full suit of ebony, no less. Full suit of new shit as well. I think I, yeah, I completely redid all of the enchants and stuff on it. We're rocking some new shit. I've used a lot of the shit that I've saved up, but also look, we've got a whole bunch of money because hey, alchemy, <laughs> right? Man, as it turns out, you really are turning shit into gold, boom. But we've got our full set of ebony armor here. I have been able to enhance it to legendary status already. Good Lord, it's incredible, it's immaculate. Look at what it can do. We've got conjuration cost reduction, magicka regen on the chest piece. I was debating, um. Oh fuck, I can't even remember what I was debating <laughs> getting on the chest piece. Whatever we had last time. But uh, nonetheless, the Conjuration spell reduction seems like a good bet, because that's probably our most commonly used spell school in combat, right? At least for the time being. Maybe Alteration is pretty useful as well? I'm not sure. But also, here on our boots, we've got Fortify One-Handed Damage. I finally disenchanted that ring. So now we're going around with boots that, instead of giving us carry weight, which is pretty damn useful, we now have one-handed damage. Same goes for gauntlets, which I don't even remember we, what we used to have on that. Nonetheless, look at that. 27% and it stacks, right? It's additive, isn't it? Surely it's not multiplicative, right? It's additive, right? Or at least these two sources are additive, but is that also multiplicative or additive with the perk damage that you get with the with the damage that you get from perks, right? Because right now we're doing double damage with one-handed. Would this be like 250 would this be would this be 152% more damage or would it be 52% times well you, you know would it be additive or multiplicative? You, you get the idea. Anyway, I mean, <laughs> on the helmet, we've got Conjuration Spells, 19% reduction, same reasons, and we enhance the Magic Resist on Ebony Shield, because I just whipped up a fucking new one, all together. 
Let's see, we've got our minor smithing unit here. May as well get rid of that, or unequip that, because I used it. Let's see, I also whipped up some sort of other unit, another crafting one. Yeah, here we go. A silver emerald necklace, which was quite useful and nice to have. But, alas, there we go. In fact, maybe we should get rid of the charm necklace. We don't exactly need it at the moment. We'll swap it out for this here, gold ruby. Good. And for our weapon, some interesting stuff you'll see. One point of frost damage. Very, very not useful in Skyrim land, frost damage. But the extra effect of it slowing dudes down may be able to just give us a strategic enough edge in combat. We'll see, because any, regardless, we're still at a point where I'm very hesitant to burn souls on refreshing our charges on our enchanted weapons, because I'd rather just make new enchantments and level up our enchanting, right? But this at least will give us like 4,000 plus, I think it was, charges of landing hits that apply freezing, right? The cryo effect, or I'm thinking of fallout, the frost effect that slows, right? Which even if you are a, a being of a Nord or even a dragon, right? That has innate frost resist or immunity. Maybe, maybe not in the case of immunity, right? Though I don't know if there's anything that can be immune. I'm not sure. But regardless, you'll still take the slowdown effect, which is way more useful, I think. Right? Especially compared to the pitiful amount of damage we would be dealing otherwise. Right? Especially since, you know, it's going to wear off. Right? This seems like a lot more of a, a smarter decision, in my opinion. At least for the time being. Once we have, like, Azura's Star, we can layer on damage left and right. But until we get, like, Azura's Star, I think this is the, the way to go. And of course, like I said, buffed them all up to Legendary, so the armor rating is through the roof. We're getting the bonus for having a matching set. All that good shit. Also, got a level, put a point in health, and you, you know I said I was going to get points in Conjuration? That way we can have the cost, but we don't really need it at the moment, right? Because we have our, our enchants pulling some weight there. And instead, you know what we needed last time, especially as we were getting hammered by some power necromancers? That's right, alteration magic to reduce incoming spell damage and all that shit. So now we're at 20% there. Pretty good, in my opinion. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. All right, and we're going to try and max it out, so we at least want to get alteration to 70. We're probably going to max everything out, but I don't know. <laughs> Maybe not. Who knows? Shit that I dislike using. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We Maybe we'll have to do archery at some point in earnest. I don't know, and light armor is going to be rough as shit <laughs> just as well. I don't know. I think training, manually training up your skills and stuff in Skyrim land seems... A bit tougher. Seems a bit tougher than the others. Okay. Or at least your your more physical ones. Can you train up against like your own summoned dude? Like if I summoned a whatever the fuck? I don't know. A low tier whatever the fuck creature? Alright. Let's do a quick save. Grab a horse. Ilya also wearing our Thieves Guild stuff because we've got that here at the ready. There we are. Cool. Now, although we are going to Markarth, the quickest way to Markarth is just the straight shot, right? But I think we f say fuck that and go the long way around to Falkreath, because this is really... This is really a great opportunity for us to hit up Falkreath, right? Otherwise, we're going to have to come back at some other point, right? Whenever we've got, I don't know, spare time to go over there. Because, you know, we don't want to break our, our rule that we've held to so far where we don't fast travel. Okay. Or, we don't fast travel. We don't use carriages to places we haven't been to yet, right? I very much enjoy that, uh, that rule. Okay. Let's see. Let's head on up over here by this area. Oh, and of course, although ebony armor is forged from, like, I don't even know, <laughs> from the volcanic glass birthed from Red Mountain or whatever, wherever the hell around here, Although that is true, it uh, it provides no warmth. It it's pretty low on the warmth meter. There's there's right. There's two tiers, two different options for warmth on armor. There's high and low, and this is one of the low ones. 
But in order to overcome that, oh shit, yo, there's a giant right here. What are you doing, dude? What are you doing? Oh shit, is that like a small giant too? Is that like a baby one? Oh, whoa, look at this cow. What the fuck? What is this magic cow? What's going on here? Is this like a baby cow as well? Is this a smaller giant and will you talk to me? Yo, this giant is peaceful. What? Yo, what the fuck is going- can I pickpocket him? No. Is that a smaller giant than usual? Or what? What's going on? What the fuck? Is this like some cut content? I have no idea what mod is adding back in all the cut content. It must be like the unofficial patch? I have no clue. And maybe that was like a toggle my dumbass left on. Yeah, look! These wolves are big! Boom! There we go. Get him! Oh shit, man. We're doing loads of damage now. Yeah, our, our axe now, thanks to the legendary upgrade, it's now doing almost double, right? Before it was like 80-something, now it's like 130-something. So, just 30, well, 20-something shy of double. Pretty fucking wild. All right, let's stow this away. We do have a quest to meet with Delphine here, but fuck that. We don't want to get all up on that shit, because I think, um, isn't that also another escort? I'm not sure. Either way, it's not too far of a run from Whiterun anyhow, so we'll pass off on that. So that way, you know, we don't, we don't have to remember like, oh yeah, Delphine wanted me to go fucking meet some old man in a sewer or some shit. I say that really flippantly, but I think that might literally be what she'll ask us to do. <laughs> that might actually be it. <laughs> that We might be at that stage. <laughs> Man, shoutouts to the few people watching this who have never played Skyrim. They, they're out there. It's wild. It's wild to me. Okay. Let's see. Are we heading in the right direction here? Here's a question. Here's a wild-ass question. While we're in this area, should we grab the stone for, like, a different set of skills because we're we have like maxed out our other bullshit haven't we let's see oh shit that wolf is about to bite my whole ass off look our smithing is at 85 we're in a good place with well our heavy armor really is is the real rough shit right because think about it my my first inclination would have been yeah obviously let's put it into wizard shit right but Almost everything except for destruction, we can just train up outside of combat, right? Or very easily get it going on, like restoration. We, we've just been leveling that up passively. And the same is true for about, what, half of the... Uh, or even more than half of the stealth ones, or thief-based ones, right? The only ones that wouldn't work would be archery, huh? That would be the only one... Or, and light armor. Well, archery is also... Fuck, I have no idea what what kind of skill is archery. Maybe it benefits from both? I'm not sure. Huh. It looks like archery might be warrior shit. I have no clue. I have no damn idea. Alright, but yeah. I think, you know what? We keep it in warrior style. To level up heavy armor, which has been going at a snail's fucking pace. Alright. Yo, look at these guys. What the fuck? Fuck off. Please! Please! Ilya, get them! Get them, Ilya! There we go. Good job. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. There we go. And we already caught the, what do you call it, up in the middle of the place. Oh, and I almost forgot. Also, in between videos, I went and hit up the Riften Fishery. Because remember, we, we signed off in Riften. And my god, the Riften Fishery, it continues to fucking deliver. Oh, jeez. You gotta love the Riften Fishery. Fuck me. Just a plethora of fishes. I think we got like 60 or 70 raw-ass fish. Because not only do the fish that you woot loot all over around that you just harvest from, the like physical objects in the world, of course they respawn. But so too do the barrels marked fish barrel. Holy shit. So much fish. We're probably never gonna go hungry ever again. I'm even debating like binding, um, what do you call it? cooked salmon steak or whatever to my bar or to my numbers 
because Salmon Steak is just rapidly becoming the purified water of Skyrim land. <laughs> you know? You know what I'm saying? I don't know. In, uh, in Fallout 4, I would just bind purified water to one of my keys because I, I just would always be drinking it. Because I was playing it. Whoa, what the fuck is this? Hey, what the fuck is this? Oh shit, this is the very beginning! Oh shit, we're back here! Oh my god, okay. <sighs> okay, well, we... <laughs> we don't need to be here! Okay, fine. Let's <laughs> let's go down here where it's... It looks warmer. I don't know if it actually is, but it, it really looks like it, right? Oh, look, there's some sort of, like, cabin out here. Let's take a look at that. Look, did you see that? There's a pot in the wild. I think that was our doing, in fact. Okay, I don't think this is the witch's cabin, because we already saw that, didn't we? Yeah. We f we found Hildegard's secret bungalow. Okay. Let's head on over. What have we got over here? Maybe this is where just, like, mooses chill. I don't know. What is this place? Oh, shit. By the way, that horse that we found, old Prior Mabel, like, appeared at one point, but then disappeared? Whoa, what the fuck is going on? Who is this? Is this a person? Who is this? Who the fuck are you? Hey, who is this guy? What? Hey! Who What's are you? What's a milk drinker like you doing out here? Go home to your mother. Ilya, I think this guy's gonna kick my ass. Let's kick his first? You shouldn't talk to me like that, you milk drinker! Oh, you called me a fucking milk drinker? Why? What are you gonna do? Cry? Now I'm gonna fucking milk you and drink it. Let's see. Back off now, intimidate. I don't have to take that from you. Yo, he's gonna fucking rumble with me. Oh my god, he's rumbling. Okay. <laughs> Get him, Ilya. Yeah, guess what, you dumbass? There's two of us. What are you even doing? Boom! Oh shit, I need, uh, speaking of. Let's get some of this shit in a salmon steak. There we go, we'll eat two more. Yeah. Fuck you, dude. Here, let's mark him for death. Cree. Boom! Ah, I've suffered worse during training! <laughs> oh, my new armor is really kicking ass here! Alright. You're a dead man! I don't think so, dude. I think it's you. Are you going to surrender or am I just going to murder you? I'm going to murder you, dude! I'm the woodland murderer! You better back the fuck off! I'm going to murder you! Oh, shit! He's knocking me around. Watch the fuck out, man! I'm going to murder you! Oh, shit! He's got heals! Okay. 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 <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. Should we- should we get anything out? Let's- let's get some- some of this. Boom. And then... Oh, fuck. My new shield, I did not bind it. Hang on a sec. There we go. Good. And then... Good. Okay. Great! Come on! Eat a butt! That's all you got! Eat a butt, dude! Eat a- eat a- eat a- eat a fucking butt! There you go. Look at that, Ilya, we fucking did it! Nailed him! Alright. <laughs> Let's, um, maybe we should try binding our new heel as well. That might be smart and clever. Close wounds, right? Yeah. Let's see. It doesn't burn too much magicka. Yeah, actually it does. Because <laughs> we're not skilled in reducing that, are we? Okay. Let's try healing hands, heals the target, fast healing, yeah. Well, it is actually more efficient, isn't it? Yeah, look at that. The efficiency is actually higher, okay. There we go. And then here, we'll just, we'll still have our regular healing bound there. Close wounds, we'll put that on four. Cool. Just in case. Alright, what have you got? Some decent shit, huh? Should we take this? Look, the value to weight ratio is pretty decent. Let's hand it off to Ilya. Ilya, check this shit out. This man wanted to kill me. I've got your back. All right. Let's see. What do you want me to carry? What a weird guy. He was just stood out here, just ready to, like, be pissed as shit at people. Okay. Let's get going, then. Good. 
Man, look at Ilya. Holy fuck. The hood goes with that. Yeah, that's a fucking look. Jeez, Ilya's ready to fucking murder as well. We're just a couple of fucking murderers out here, huh? All right. Well, we've lost um, our stolen horse, but it's fine. <laughs> We're nearly to Falkreath. Okay. What is this place? Oh, shit. There's a power bear. Okay. Look at this. I'm about to summon a power moose. To me, moose lord. <laughs> Boom. Oh, shit. I got its bone break fever. Look at my fucking power. Look. The bears can't even hurt me. I'm impervious to bears. I rule over you bears. I am the bear god. What have you got? I'm ripping off your bear skin as well. Oh shit. Where are we in combat with? Billy, are you like tripping balls? It's freaking me the fuck out. Oh shit, the crab lords. A fugitive as well. Take this and hold on to it. I'll be back for it later. Okay. Are you good? He's on the run Don't from crabs! It. Hang on, if I if I just stay here, are crabs going to kill this man? Oh no, Ilya's going to save him from crabs. You got a little something there, dude. <laughs> All right. Slow down, explain yourself. No time to talk. Snitch or double cross me and I'll kill you. I mean it. Okay. Jeez, man, he means it. Shit, I'm going slow as hell. Why? What did he, what did you give me? What did you give me? Oh god. <clears throat> All right. I'm just going to grab this root. What did this guy give me? Some kind of heavy-ass armor? Oh, God, a dwarven shield of waning fire. He stole that from the crabs? What the fuck? Okay. I think he died, Ilya. I think he just died. <laughs> Did that man just go... Oh! Is that... That's not him? <laughs> Who is that? Hey. Hey, fella. Do you want this shield? Is that what- Did you see someone run past just now? <laughs> you might want to watch out. Uh, no, I didn't see anyone lie. Well, if you do, grab him and yell. Bastard stole from me. In the middle of you fighting a All fucking right. spider lord? Wow, he <laughs> stole his shield right as he was about to block and he got poissoned. Is this guy gonna die to a spider? He might. Wow! Listen to him, he's coughing up his own blood! No, Ilya doesn't even give a shit it. now. That's your best. No, I think he's gonna win. It's all clear now. Where are you? Okay. <laughs> what the fuck is going on over here? Shit! I can't drop- Should I drop the thing? What if he shows up right as I drop it? And he gets real pissed at me for dropping it. Let's see, let's apply- Oh wow, that thing had an amethyst in it. Okay. You can't hide from me. No sign of him. Yeah, no sign of him. No sign of him. What the fuck is going on? What is going on? Ever hey, this guy gave me a shield. I'm so encumbered. Please. I, I want to see what's going on in the murder woods. Come on. It's Halloween and everything. What the fuck? <laughs> this was not a treat. It was a trick. What? Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa! They, he, found, he found him! Hey, he found the fugitive! <laughs> oh, this is gonna be awkward if he does kill him. Oh, shit, did he just kill him? Wow, I've never seen them find each other. <laughs> hey, maybe don't kill him. He's he's really begging for his life there. Hey, I got the shield. Come on, don't you don't gotta kill him. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> What the fuck? What? True Nords never back down. It's what's gonna happen here. Where's he gone? Where's Come he gone? Here. Yo, he's hunting him down. You are. Oh shit. He is a hunter for real, a hunter of men. <laughs> oh fuck. Jeez, he doesn't even have his shield anymore. Come on, get him! Why is he so afraid? Look at him hide! I love a challenge! Oh god. <laughs> oh, this game is amazing! Oh! Is he dead? Oh god! What are you. True Nords never back down! Fuck! We're routed! Fall back! 
Dude, where's she gonna keep running to? Oh look, he's really in like his death death knell. Oh, he's about to die and cry. Oh, look out! Run! Oh! You think you can take me? <laughs> take cover behind the stump! <laughs> oh no! One more and surely he's dead. Oh! Look at Hawkeye over here, yo. What are you doing? <laughs> Come on! How many fucking arrows have you gone through? That moose is gonna run into him and he'll fall over. Oh! Oh, I thought it really happened. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Skyrim belongs to the North! <laughs> <laughs> this is fucking amazing. Wow, he got away! He escaped! Oh shit. About a million fucking power wolves. <laughs> Alright. Did he die? No. He didn't die. What, what would he have died from? The wolves? You think the wolves got him? Fuck, I can't drop this, can I? Oh my god, is that his bod? Right there? Let's see, let's zoom out. Oh my god, the fugitive got killed! He slayed him! I've never seen this happen before! <laughs> Wait! I thought I was gonna get some gold for turning it in! Oh, man. Well. <laughs> Look who it is! <laughs> what will happen? Oh, he's mining over here. Oh, look at him go. Okay, great. <laughs> I love it. Let's see. What's on my six? Is it Dread Zombie? No, it's still Revenant. Hmm. You know what? I, I probably, in retrospect, should have uh, <laughs> tended to that. Right? Because we can now summon that shit. Easy enough. Let's see here. In fact, let's get some of this shit going on. Good. Perfect. And... Maybe we'll keep all those Atronachs at the ready because it's good for dragons, right? Let's see. Dread Zombie. Get rid of... Revenant here. Good. And we may as well have, like, a Dramora Lord at the ready. Why not? I love magic. Okay. Let's see. Where is our... Oh, shit. <laughs> what was it called? <laughs> what was the zombie one called? Uh, let's see. Dread Zombie. There we go. Cool. Dude, check it out. You know what? Uh... No, he's dead! He's already dead! <laughs> Look! What do you want, little elf? Hey, check this out, dude. <laughs> Look! You just committed murder! <laughs> I'm with the Dark Brotherhood. I'm here to fucking recruit or murder you or something. Is this worth keeping? Should I should I even keep this? What's the value to weight ratio? 50? Uh, Ilya, Still can you hold here. on to it? What do you want me to carry? <laughs> I guess I just have this now. <laughs> okay, there we go. Look, Let's it's the going, fugitive! <laughs> Alright, he doesn't give a shit. Let's see, what's on him? Oh. Money. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> He's getting robbed by everybody today! <laughs> Happy Halloween, asshole! Blah, 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 blah. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh shit, is he? Why is he coming after me? Oh, is it because of the fugitive? Yes. Oh, wow, he really disintegrated. He's gone forever. Did you scoop up his ashes? Oh, he ate him. Oh. Speak, elf. Okay, let's go over here. What's this? Iron? Do we need some iron? Why not? Here, Ilya. Still here. What do you want me Let to Let me carry? do a little bit of mining here. Why the hell not? Let's see. Get the pickaxe. Good. Let's... And... There we Go are. Ahead. Great. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> How many veins is this? One or two? I'm willing to say two. But I could be wrong. Yeah, look, it's two. Great. Okay. We can build a house out of this shit. Love it. There we are. Okay, Ilya, take this shit back. Still here. What do you want me to carry? Okay, and then you take... Oh yeah, you should take this stolen shit too. <laughs> and... All of these. There we go. Thank you, Ilya. Let's see. Where's our legendary axe? There it is. 
Okay, now let's finally check out this creepy cabin. What's going on here? Whole bunch of action going on around. Oh, it's like a little farm. Oh, Pine Watch. Okay, cool. Oh, look at this. Oh shit, a load of potatoes and leeks. Do I have potatoes on me? No, I don't. Hey, these are free. Oh shit, reality has changed. These potatoes just experienced a dragon break. Okay. What's back and around here? Anything good? Snowberries, more leeks, more potatoes. Okay. Sure. I guess we'll take these. Does someone actually live here? What is this place? How come I can just take everything? That's that's pretty weird, right? <laughs> okay. Huh. Is this illegal? Is this a crime? <laughs> I just I'm I'm in. Hello. Who lives here? What's going on? What is this place? Oh shit. There's a red. Oh shit! Whoa! Yeah. Whoa! 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 What are you doing? Whoa! Come on! Who are you? Why? Are, why are you here? Let's eat some salmon steak. <laughs> oh, fuck! You fucking maniac! Good God! Oh God! Uh, okay. <laughs> that was uh, a little contentious there. There we go. Great. Boom. Oh. Look at how much fucking damage I do, dude. To die. Is the damage buff from my, like, hands and feet, is that reflective in the, uh, weapon tooltip and shit? Oh, fuck! Oh, yeah! Mm. Got him. Cool. Man, what is all this shit? Warning. You've all been warned about trying to break into my treasure room, but Roris didn't think I was serious. Now, he's dead. You've all had your cut of the take already, and if I catch any of you dung lickers, oh my god, we've taken a step up from Milk Drinker, trying to break in again, I won't let the traps kill you. I'll do it myself! Signed, Rigel Strongarm. Oh my god, Rigel is fucking not kidding around. Okay. What else is around here? Ooh, a fun hat. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess these are bandits and I can steal from them. Cool. I love that. Okay. What else is around here? Pheasant breast, an empty barrel. Look at all this weird shit. Someone ready to just become the Dovahkiin. Let's see, honeycombs. Oh look, that's actually, wow, they're so heavy, dude. Fuck it, I'm taking them. Potion of true shot. What about in here? Creepy stuff, saber cat pelt. F it, we'll give that shit to Ilya. This dresser is filled with weird stuff. Song of Pelinal. Okay. Did you have anything on you? Wow, a bunch of money. Okay. Value to weight ratio is Garbo on that. Hey, anybody down here? Was that Rigel? Was she Rigel's strong arm? I don't know. Where's your treasure room at, dude? Hmm. Maybe one of these is like a fall. Oh, this is definitely, <laughs> this is the treasure room. <gasps> Look at this. What creepy little treasure room, huh? Oh, I'm about to get a treat for sure. Note to Rorlack. We got the right cart this time. The note has been sent and we'll see how they respond. In the meantime, we'll be breaking down this stuff. You keep selling off the wood to keep our front. If we can get a good price for the mold, we should be set for a while. The mold? Y'all are selling mold? Oh, and we left some wine for you in a bucket behind the shelf. Consider it a bonus. Oh, also, sign, sign Rigel Strongarm. That's my voice now. <laughs> All right. Let's see. What's over here? Troll fat. Great. Whole bunches of herbs hanging around. What's in here? Anything good? Charcoal. No thanks. Inside of this. Weird shit. A bed I can't sleep in. Oh shit, I just took like a ladle. Okay. Let's deposit that. 
Oh dear lord, where is it? Wood ladle. There we go. Eliminated. A garlic. A cooking pot. Right there. Bunches of salt. Cabbages as well. What is this? Am I for real going to get arrested or what? What's going to happen here? I got so many brooms. Alright. Push button. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. Hey look, there's money leading in here. Oh, and here's the, uh, the wine. The bonus wine. Boom. I don't give a shit. Oh, is it cleared now? Or is that just like for real art? Ding, 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 ding. Turn that on. Yo, what's going on? What is this damn place? I vaguely remember it as well. Is this for like some kind of weird ass quest? Oh shit. There. Hey, <laughs> there's a bunch of fucking people in here getting into the something. treasure room. Okay. Cream! Cream! Good. Okay. Fuck. Let's see here. Let's get a... Let's get a Storm Atronach out. There we go. Good. Cool. Oh my god. Holy shit. Stormy Stefan has really fucked shit up. Oh my god. Yo. You one-shot him. What the fuck? Am I still on legendary mode or am I like dumb as hell? Let's see. No, we are. We just really had that big of a leap in power. <laughs> Great. I love it. Okay, what have you got? Anything? A lockpick? I'll take it. Yoink. This. Some restoratives. What's on you? Anything good? All right. Stefan, you know what? I love you, but... Oh, look. The Red Kitchen Reader. Ooh, yeah. Very good. Okay. Is this like a Dark Brotherhood zone or what? I've got your back. What do you want yeah, me to carry? Move around some junk here. Oh gosh, she's fairly encumbered already. That ain't great. Ugh, these, and how about some of this shit? Bear claws. Oh look, we've got like a, yeah, these pelts. Oh shit. Okay, <laughs> it ain't looking great. <laughs> All right, we'll deposit that. Oh, that's the best we can do for now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Here, sorry Stefan, but I want a Zombo friend. There we go, look, a shitload of cheese as well. Dude, what is this place? Pine Watch, what are you? I've never seen anything quite like that. Like what? Oh shit, whoa! Oh, Ilya, you scared the shit out of me. Look, they've, they've dug up an ancient Nordic ruin. Oh shit, it's locked from the other side. Okay. Let's see. Who's over here? Some sick bastard. Oh, I've shit. Yep. Okay. wonder if I have a black soul gem. Boom. Oh, ah! 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 fuck! It's nothing. Oh, gosh. Take him out. Take him out, team. Let's see. Let's get some juice in us here. Extreme magicka. Great. Cool. Just scratch. Yeah! <laughs> My god, we're ripping apart dudes left and right. This was a two-handed McGee. Here, let's also summon him out just as well. Oh shit, we're low on power. There we go. Power time! Woo! Get some light here as well. Dude, Pine Watch, what's going on with this place? Okay. Are we about to find like some core kind of cool ass word wall in here or what maybe I'd be down for that and who is Rigel I have no clue okay <laughs> it never gets old all right man necromancy ain't half bad is it <laughs> I can't believe they people tried to outlaw it it's it's pretty fun <laughs> okay Let's see, over here. What's with this? Why is it so well lit? It looks like a trap. I guess it's safe. 39. I'll take it. Ilya just pierced a sword with a ice missile of some sort. Cabbages flying everywhere. Okay. What's over here? Shitloads of wood. Oh shit. Some kind of people roaster. Oh god. They're both Khajiit. Were they like racists or something? What the fuck's going on? 
What is this fucked up place? I feel kind of bad about that. I mean, they're already dead, but <laughs> it wasn't right. Okay. Where's this go? Should we trace this? Look, you can't get me. Oh god. <laughs> Suddenly I felt like as soon as I said that, I jinxed it and something was about to get me. <laughs> oh, okay. This leads down into... Okay, I see. Oh shit, look, there's some goodies right there. Huh. Okay. Should I... No, I know how this goes. This will fucking kill me if I try that. Okay. Don't I have telekinesis here at the ready? Yeah, there we are. Okay, coin purse. Yep. Beautiful. Love it. There is a potion of healing. Oh, look, we can even scan through all this for what lurks within. Okay. Boom. Just enough. Beautiful. Okay. Let's head on up and out. Look at that. Fucking telekinesing it. Love that. Okay. Bunches of cabbages. Let's head on up. I think we explored everything in this lower section, right? Feels that way. Okay, this is back where we started. So let's head on along this, like, scaffolding. Cool. That is locked up. Okay. Over here, is this locked up? No. Is this trapped, though? Is there, like, a secret trap here that's going to obliterate me? Nah, we're fine. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay. We do have, like, 50 picks on Ilya, though, so it's fine if we go through a shitload of these. It's A-okay. Oh, God. <laughs> All right. There we are. Easy. What we got here? Elixir of Strength? Whoa, that gave me a level. Yo, I love it. Okay, loads of wine. I may as well eat it, right? There we go. Okay, let's see. Alto wine. Cool. Regular wine. Wonderful. Good, good, good. Just top off our hunger. Okay. Ooh. Did Ilya shoot through there or something? Must have. Oh, okay. That's where the two-handed dude was. Okay. So then we need to head this direction. Ah, here we are. Yo, what is this place? Oh. Like got us. Oh, oh shit! Okay. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Fuck! Oh my god, we're getting hit by a bunch of shit. Okay, let's heal on up here real quick so we don't, like, get one shot or something. Alright. Scarf down some of that. Where's my time slowdown? That was always nice when that would happen. Look, he's so slow now. Look, this Inchan has been great. Fuck me. <laughs> that fucking Archer Man is back there obliterating me. Get them, whoever. There we go. Good. Okay. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Jeez. Let's drink some more of that. Okay, let's get unrelenting force here. Oh, now it doesn't when he's a little too far. Good. Eat a butt. Alright. Good. Let's see, can I summon him from his, uh, oh, okay. I mean, I could. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's see. Do I have, like, a regen magica unit? Or is this poison? A whole bunch of shit. Right, let's just drink some of these minor ones. Right. Oh, shit. Okay, a bit more. Cool. All right. Beautiful. Where's Ilya even at? Did she fall or something? Must have. Let's turn this back on. Cool. <laughs> Look at him here. <laughs> there we go. That evens the odds a bit. Great. Love it. Get him! Look, knock that shit on top of their fucking head! There we are. Good. Oh, yes! Oh, very nice. Alright. Why is it stacked like this? Look. 
That's so strange. Is this like a sneak zone or what? What kind of a- this is like a very authored looking dungeon. Like this is part of a big quest. <laughs> and that, uh, that shoe with the, the coins on the ground definitely seemed really familiar. Huh. <laughs> this has got to be for something important. Wouldn't it be funny if this was like a thieves guild area? <laughs> like we come here right after. What the fuck? All right. Anything else around here? Hmm. I think we're good for now. Anything to do with these? Empty. Em oh, nope. This one is not. Salt. Okay. Food. Beautiful. Need that. More food. We'll take a couple for the road. Okay. In here. Raw flowers. Stuff my face with that shit. Okay. Dresser. Perfectly lodged within. Look at that. That's just interior design. A cupboard? Lootable from the top? Okay. Some weird eggshells inside. Neat. Alright. Oh look. Hey, we gotta use our power here, huh? Okay, I'm down for that. Boom! Oh shit! Oh my god. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> okay, maybe maybe we don't do that there. What the fuck? What happened? Did I like position it incorrectly? That should have worked. It's never done that before. Let's take that money. We'll leave that sword though. Don't want any to, anything to do with that. Let's see, more salt. Jeez, look at all these little sacks here, just filled with salt. Cabbages as well. Flour. Neat. Okay, now let's try this. Let's see if I... Is it that my head is ramming into that shit, or what? Huh. Like if I go over here and then do it. Boom! Okay, good. This has a novice lock on it. What's inside? Huh? What have we got? Oh, nice. Okay. More magicka. Okay. What's around here? Bunches of fucking rocks. Oh, look, it goes deeper still. Dude, what is this place? What is this? Time oh, shit. To end this. There's a vicious man here as well. Okay. Game. Now, you know what? Let's get, uh... Let's get this friend out. Let's get Stefan out. There you go. Shock him! Blast him! Shoot him! Stefan, what the fuck are you doing? Well, Stefan, what the fuck are you doing? No. This ends now. Okay. Let's see. Let's get... Hmm. Should we knock him down there? Yeah, let's do that. Boom! See ya! Eat a butt. Get him, Stefan. Get him! Zap him! Blast him! Look, Stefan loves to cast. Stefan is a caster. Oh, shit! Oh my god, Stefan has like a power fart. Okay. Stefan doesn't give a shit now. Stefan is just doing all sorts of shit. Whoa! What is that fart? Is that like a point blank AoE? Is that it casting the. Yeah, the, like, damage over time point-blank AoE? Maybe. Oh shit, Stefan's about to fucking die. No one an orc. Oh yeah, he's an orc, so he's, like, resilient to that shit. Okay, how about, uh, how about this one? Oh shit. Okay. <laughs> Here. How about this one now? That's right! <laughs> yes! Oh, they have the voice! They have the Oblivion voice, dude! Oh, yes! You puny Here we go. <laughs> Dude, what is up? Oh my gosh. He's a Dramora Lord, but he looks oily enough, right? Uh, it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell here. Okay, what have we got? 100 Quatlus? That'll do. Okay. Okay. All right. What would, what would their name even be? Dramora. What's a name that starts with D-R? I don't know. All I can think of is Dre. <laughs> it, can't, it can't be Dramora Dre, can he? <laughs> oh my gosh. He <laughs> can't be Dramora Dre. We can't, that's all I can think of. Oh shit. 
Is Drevin a name? That sounds like a fantasy name. That doesn't sound like a real person's name. Are there real people named Drevin? What's another name that starts with Drew? Dramora Drew. There we go. Okay. I don't know. I kind of like Dre. <laughs> He's going to be Dramora Dre now. <laughs> All right. It's Dramora Dre. Fine. What is this shit over here? Okay. Okay. Let's, let's fucking go. Dramora Dre! Get him! <laughs> he sounds so cool. <laughs> oh, fuck! His power slam. Okay. Let's get some regen and a little bit of healing. There we go. Beautiful. I love it. Okay, and let's also mark him for death. Good. Oh my god, look at Dramora Dre going through! Chopping them the fuck up! Oh my god, Dramora Dre is tearing shit up. Let's see. Let's grab some of this. Rora's letter. Oh, we should investigate that afterward. Okay. Uh-oh, bone chunks. Better be careful. <laughs> yes, bring me honor, Dre! Bring me honor! Destroy him! Oh, yes. <laughs> Very good. Eat shit. Eat shit. Eat shit. Oh, yes. Who? Who is it, Dre? Who? Oh, look, there's someone, like, on the other side of this rock wall. Okay. Let's take a look at this. Wow, glass arrows, huh? Holy shit, let's take them. Okay. Rora's letter again. Okay, let's read it. Oh, shit, spot. Okay. Where'd it go? Let's see. Rora's letter. Oh, shit, I just put back on him. Okay, read it. Let's see. Come on, it... Oh, yeah, this is for some... From This isn't from Rigel. Come on, it won't be that bad. Rigel may be paranoid, but she's as dumb as a mammoth. Body hair like one too. I'm just saying, if we can if we can get into that treasure room, we would be set. We could just take the money and head north to catch a ship. I know a guy whose cousin knows a guy that could get us set up with some pirates in Hammerfell. And in the meantime, we could live high on that money for months. Oh my gosh. Maybe we'll meet those pirates who know Rora in a future installment. Dude, is Dre tearing it up over there? No, Dre, like, fucking fell over and died. Okay. Turn the lights on here. Let's see. They got a big thing of booze. A whole bunch of lootables. What have we got here? Anything good in this? Money. Always good. Okay. Up here, salt. I guess also always good to a degree. Over here, sacks of flour. Wonderful. Barrel with some potatoes. Love it. Okay. I almost feel like I wish um, the game would let me know ahead of time. Hey, dumbass, don't go inside this dungeon. It's for a quest later. Because <laughs> I feel like that's totally what's happening right now. Okay. Carrots. We'll take a couple. I think we can make a stew from that. Barrels. Green apple. Okay. More tomatoes. I'll take one. Nope, oh, nothing in there. Nothing in there. Okay. Good, good, good. Oh, look, an expert lock. Ooh. What have we got? What secrets? Oh, a quicksilver ingot. Okay. You link all that stuff up. What else? How do we get into this secret wall? Shit, do you think it's only for, like, the, the quest that we're meant to be here for? <laughs> have we hit the end of the line? I don't know. Maybe. All right, let's roll up here. Look, there is this passage. Let's do a quick save. Dude, what is this place? What is this weird place? Oh my God, they kept people in here. What the fuck? What were they doing? Oh God. Look at there. you. I'm gonna fucking rip you apart, you shirtless man. Get him, Dre. Yeah. Oh shit, that is not Dre at all. That's Francine. <laughs> Oh, I missed Dre already. There we go. Look, I can, like, fucking absorb a two-handed smash as well. Incredible. Let's see. What do I have here? Fuck it. Let's have some fun. <laughs> I don't even bother to say Fusro now. It's just... <laughs> it's good enough. <laughs> it works. Good. Okay. 
Great. Love it. Okay. Let's actually bind... <laughs> Let's bind the good doctor here. There we go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know what? Maybe it's a good thing that I thought of Dre before I thought of Drew. <laughs> I feel like it's paid dividends. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's equip this because I'm full. Bandit, what have you got? Some ale. I'll eat it. There we go. Cool. Let's do a quick save. Surely there there would be that? some sort of power boss, right? Okay. Oh, good God. Go ahead. Oh, good Try God. Fight back. Oh, I'm out of shit. Okay. Good Lord, we can't even get Dre out unless we've got a bunch of magicka. Fuck. Okay. Let's just rumble. Francine is still here anyway. Oh shit. No, she's not. <laughs> she's extremely not. There we go. Shirtless man to me! Good. Fuck him up. Nah. Fuck him up! No worries. <laughs> <laughs> They're getting worse, aren't they? <laughs> there we go. Chop him up. Chop him up. Chop him up. That's the best you can do. Boom! Block this shit, you fool! Yeah, you can't! There we go. Oh no, my shirtless man is walking into a cart! He's not doing anything! Oh, fuck. Look at him go! He's a fool! Oh, man! <laughs> Alright, I guess it's fine. Here, let's get a different... Oh, shit. I can't even... Oh, shit, shit, shit. How about now? Nope, okay. A little bit longer. Now. Now. Okay. All right. We'll just watch him kind of dance here for a bit. All right. Now. There we go. Beautiful. Love it. Let's see. What's inside? Nothing worthwhile. Oh, let's do a quick save. Now let's run up here while we have a two-hand Magoo. Oh, shit. Zombo zone. Okay. Does this open anywhere? Oh, look. It's a bonus fun zone. All right. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, shit. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. <laughs> okay. 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 We... Oh, God. <laughs> it was at the top, wasn't it? It was at 12 o'clock. Okay. Good. Oh, look. This thing is rigged. Look. Ah, look at that. <laughs> Definitely. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. Okay. See, da, da, da. ah, there we go. Oh God, they're still gonna get me. Am I about to get got or what? Is it about to get me? Let's deposit that in there. Let's see, don't I have some trash to throw on this? Yeah, I don't want the pelt. Wow, what the fuck happened? Why? Why are you still gonna get me? Did I mess it up? Oh, does it just activate it whenever you disarm it, quote unquote? Maybe. Oh shit, a stone of berry. Okay. The cake and the diamond. The first hold revolt. Shit, I don't know which ones of these we've read or not. Thief of virtue. The cake and the diamond. I guess I'll take it. What if I haven't read it yet? Okay. How about the first hold revolt? I have no clue. Okay. Let's see. Here, Ilya. I'm right behind Give me you. some of the weird what garbage. Do you want me to carry? Let's see. We can dump these pelts. We don't really need them, do we? Okay. You know what? I really should have stored all this leather. <laughs> That's 64 units of leather. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Lead on. We can, like, drop it off somewhere or whatever, right? There we go. And then... Still here. What do you want me to carry? This to you. And let's see. Let's give you these weird books, right? How about... Oh, shit. Or maybe some of this shit, right? Yeah, some of this. Here. How about a Quicksilver ingot? That's good. Yeah, look. Look, this, this is working out. Honeycombs. Beautiful. Okay. Yeah, look, we're getting our carry weight down. Oh, perfect. Okay. Lead on. Good. Well, they already really did most of the work for us here. A lot of silver there. Wow, some good woot loot. Okay. Cool. A lot of miscellaneous good-ass items. Okay. Quick save. Did you hear something? Yeah, it's me! 
Surprise! Oh, shit. Okay, let's get Stefan out. Whoa, there's a lot of them. Okay. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Got him. Nailed it. Here, let's apply some poison. Let's get our carry weight down here as well. We can do an... Ooh, shit. Here, let's do some of this. Good. Okay, great. Cool. Okay, well, let's apply more of this poison here. Ooh, shit. All right. That dude back there is trying to fucking snipe me. Here we are. Oh, shit, our friend has fallen and died. Oh, my God. <laughs> no, it's not! It's the end for you, dude! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, apply some more. Great. Boom, gotcha. Look at these fucking archer dudes. Oh, shit! He, like, zoomed up onto me. What are you doing, you zoom lord? Wait, is Stefan still alive? Stefan didn't die, dude! Stefan is back there hacking. All right, let's ravage their bullshit. Why not? And fortify our own bullshit. And drink a drink of three times. Cool. All right. I'm afraid to blast them because we might get an opportunity for some sweet AOE. Right. There we go. Gotcha. All right, let's do a little bit of healing here. Wonderful. Surprise, asshole, it's me! <laughs> I learned from you, Trey! <laughs> there we go. There we are. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, I'm having a great time. Wow, it's so good to be able to just obliterate people. Ah, man, fuck. All right, let's turn the lights on. Ooh, what have we got around here? Money. Oh, I love that. <laughs> All right, what's in this dude? An arrow. More money. Whoa, an amulet of Debella. Wow, 15 speech. Weird. I'll take it. Man, we drank a lot of potions there, huh? Our potion weight really was a lot. <laughs> oh, look. Rora's letter. Oh, the mystery continues. Come on, it won't be that bad. Oh, no, wait, body hair like one, too. Yeah. Rigel is so hairy. Whoa, hairy like a mammoth. I just want to snuggle. <laughs> all right, warning. You've all been... Oh, no, okay. Now he's dead. Right. Oh, I dropped it. Okay. Let's do a quick save. What's this? A dwarven arrow. <gasps> Goodness. Nordic bow, steel sword. Merchant stuff. Do a little healing. Cool. Okay, what else is around here? A bunch of ale, a fish. Okay, baked potatoes. Should we take these? Yes, we should. We'll eat them on the spot. Okay, let's see. Baked potatoes and grilled leeks. I love it. Okay, what's up and over here? A whole bunch of booze, anything hidden. Oh, look, poison, aversion to shock. Okay. Eat some of that. Cool. Loads of booze. We don't really need it, though. Especially when we're just eating raw out of barrels, which is way more fast and effective. Okay. Anything inside of this one? No. Fair enough. Look, is this another one? Another same warning? Oh, shit. I took, like, the dagger. Let's see. What's this say? You've all been war- oh, okay, okay, okay. Whoop, there it goes. Let's drop the dagger. Don't need that. Do a quick save. Oh, and what's going on in here? Look, bone charms. Ooh, conspicuous. Okay, this sh oh, fuck. That's not muffle at all. That is really extremely not muffle. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is muffle, though. Cool. All right. Quick save. Oh, I'm getting sleepy. All right. What would even happen if I hit this? Why do I even bother with it? Oh. Ilya. <laughs> Ilya, come on. <laughs> I'm trying to be sneaky. Uh, 
look. Okay, real Baron's eye, mixed unit tactics, okay. Who is Rigel? Look, all of these letters are all here. Father's missive. By the nine, Rigel, think about what you're doing. I don't care if you kill off a couple skooma-headed Khajiit traitors. They have no business being in Skyrim anyway. They are racists. I knew it. I fucking knew it. But think about what you're doing. There are armies fighting out there, and they're bound to use the roads from time to time. They're going to start noticing if traders go missing. And for that matter, why don't you just join up with one of the armies? I gave up on marrying you off to some merchant's son since you got the face of a skeever. But that doesn't mean you couldn't put a helmet on and find some work for a soldier. Use those meaty arms of yours, girl, and quit sending me money. I don't need your charity. Signed, Da. Man. Poor Rigel, honestly. All right. Let's see, anything else over here? Too bad we can't like recruit Rigel into like the Thieves Guild or something. Oh shit, is this Rigel over here? Is this Rigel? Oh shit, it is. This is Rigel. <laughs> oh, the treasure room. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, I can't steal that, though. Okay. Okay, here we go. Power slam time. Power slam. I missed. I missed! Oh, oh she's waking up! No! No! You picked a bad time to get lost, All right, there we go. All right. Do your worst. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Think you can take me? Oh, poor Rigel. I feel bad about this. Yeah! There we go. Oh, oh god, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. All right. It's done. <laughs> okay. What have we got here? Anything good? Nah. All right. Let's see. A potion of some sort. Let's turn this on. Grand Soul Gem. Now that's worth it. That's worth the price of admission. Alright, Songs of the Return. Too bad we couldn't, like, romance Rigel's strong arm and then go kill her father. There's a side quest and a half. Alright, let's see. Gods and Worship. Okay, anything in here? Oh, look, there is some sort of axe. An Orcish War Axe of Scorching. Do we know of Scorching? Yes, we do. And the value to weight ain't great, so we're dropping it. Okay. What's inside of here? Shit. <laughs> okay. There we are. And what's this? But 31 quatloos. Love it. Okay. Anything else while we're going through here? Look, a uh, repair zone. Galarian the Mystic. Ingol and the Sea Ghost. Antecedents of Dwemer Law. Real Baron's Eye. Mysterious Akavir Firmament. Hope of the Redoran. Okay. Fair enough. Look, see, I feel like Rigel Strongarm and I would have gotten along well. Right? I'm always getting cold. She's incredibly hairy. <laughs> right? It works out. She loves butts, clearly. So do I. It seems like a match made in heaven. Look, she even left little treats out for me. <laughs> I love these. <laughs> it really was. We would have been a, a power couple. What the fuck? What's going on over here? Draugr with a Conjurer's Potion. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's do a quick save here. And oh my god, a master lock on it. But we have the power key. What lurks within? Oh shit. Yo, what does lurk within? I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, we should be careful about that. In fact, I'm going to be so careful, I'm not even going to trust you, Ilya. Huh. There we go. Oh, those are gonna all shoot when you step on that, Ilya. Oh, she didn't activate it. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Oh! Oh, careful there, Ilya. Okay. Look at this. Some sort of scrying unit. Okay. Let's just go around that. Whoa, fuck! Oh, I'm the luckiest man! Wow! Whoa! whoa. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, Ilya, I'm so lucky. Wow. <laughs> and they said luck wasn't in this game. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Happy Halloween, huh? <laughs> Whoa! Jeez! Another one! 
<laughs> oh man, I'm avoiding them all. Look at me. Oh shit. What is this? Cool music. Why? Oh look, the treasure room. Where does this go? Back outside to Pine Watch. Oh, oh whoa, shit! Oh that god! Is that your best? <laughs> Sorry, Ilya, did I did I do that? Did I step on something? <laughs> okay. Whoops. <laughs> Well, I guess, man, we should take all this shit, huh? Oh, Curious Silver Mold. What's that for? That's for a quest, isn't it? Huh. What is that quest about? Oh, weird. I'm taking it nonetheless. Okay, let's just take all this shit. Find gold ore for Medesi. Yeah, that silver candle mold or whatever. That's definitely for a quest of some sort. Okay. Huh. Weird, weird, weird. Oh, shit. Okay. How do I... How do I get this... Light? Okay, good. Good, good, good. Alright, what's inside this chest? Anything useful? Oh, yes. Master Robes of Illusion. A cool necklace. And a hat. Meow. Alright. Let's see. Can I sprint <gasps> while I'm... Ooh, yeah, I can. Didn't want to get hit by all that shit that you got impaled by there, Ilya. Alright. Whew. I'm I'm a delicate flower. Okay. <laughs> Great. Well, holy shit, I suppose when next we come back, we will arrange our inventory and all of that. And we'll head back out into Pine Watch and be ready to head on off over to Falkreath, right? Good lord, how far are we from Falkreath? Let's check the world map. Not far at all at all. And thank goodness for that because we need to rent a room there in Sleepy. Anyway, if you'd like to stick around, although we have gone super duper over time. I did promise we would read Cabin in the Woods, so let's give it a read, although we have, like I said, gone super duper over time. Let's see here. Had too much fun in this dungeon. I have no idea what that candle thing is for, but maybe it's a good thing that we got it. All right, now if you'll excuse me. Oh look, the Cabin in the Woods volume two. What? Huh. Well, that's problematic. Should we not read this? I don't know. Fuck it. Let's read it. It didn't specify volume two, so maybe there is no volume one, right? All right. Now, if you'll excuse me, like I was about to say, I'm going to take a quick drink here. The Cabin in the Woods, volume two, as told by Mogan, son of Molag. Late one night, a few seasons ago, a soldier was returning home after several bloody battles. He decided he would save some gold and decided to cross the pine forest on foot. The first day of his journey was rather uneventful. The soldier stuck to the main path and kept a brisk pace. When it started getting dark, he set up his bedroll, built a small fire, and cooked up some rabbit he had caught. A fine day indeed, he thought to himself as he fell asleep. Partway through the evening, the soldier was waken up by soft sobbing in the distance. He grabbed his sword, assuming it to be a bandit trick, but pretended to sleep so he could get the jump on them. After a few minutes, the sobbing started moving away from his camp until he could no longer hear it. For the rest of the night, he slept with one eye open. Day two, the soldier awoke from what rotten sleep he could catch and started off through the forest at a quicker pace, intending to put distance between himself and whatever he had heard last night. As the day went on, it began to rain heavy, so the soldier built himself a little shelter for the evening so he could remain dry while he slept. It took him a little longer to fall asleep, with thoughts of the previous night fresh in his mind, but he eventually slept. This time he awoke to sobbing that sounded like it was right outside his shelter. The soldier grabbed his sword and crawled out of the shelter. In front of the fire, he saw the back of a ghostly woman sobbing into her hands. The soldier mustered his courage and asked her what was wrong. No answer. He began to slowly approach, but before he could reach her, she turned and screamed at him. The ghostly woman raised an axe and began to run at the soldier, disappearing before she made contact. 
The soldier took off into the night, with just his sword in hand. He ran until the first light of dawn, where he started down the road again, as fast as he could move. The third day was bright and sunny, but the soldier, rattled and sleepless, didn't even notice. He moved as fast as he could, trying to get through the forest before nightfall. As darkness began to fall, he saw a cabin just off the road and thought to himself it would be a good place to hunker down for the night. After arriving at the cabin, he spent some time blocking the doors and windows. Nothing would get in. Despite his preparations, he could not sleep. He sat in what used to be the cabin's bedroom, staring at the barricaded door, shaking. Eventually, he could keep his eyes open no longer and fell asleep. This time, he awoke to laughing on the other side of the barricaded door. It sounded like the woman from before, but he refused to believe it was her. The soldier burst through the barricaded door into the main room to find the ghostly woman from the night before, staring at him at the ground, laughing hysterically with axe in hand. He began to relentlessly attack the ghostly woman, but he could feel his strikes were less effective. He used a scroll of firebolt which drew a scream from her, and she exploded, disappearing. The ordeal was over. The ghost was gone. The soldier slept well that night, and the next day made excellent distance through the woods. As the sun began to set, he came out on the other side of the forest and looked back, remembering the days before. As he turned and started walking away from the woods, he could swear he heard the sobbing again. Eh, that wasn't that scary, was it? I heard this was a scary one. This ain't no Paula, right? Paula's where it's at. Fuck, that was... That one was actually a little horrific. I mean, he, it was actually a ghost, right? It was actually a ghost, and he, which is why he couldn't kill it. He had to use magic, right? That's totally what it was. Huh. Is that still in Skyrim, where um, you can't hurt ghosts and stuff with mundane weapons? Is that still uh, something that exists in this game? Because I don't think I've ever gotten to a point where I had to fight some sort of ghost when I was still using mundane, unenchanted weapons. Because... You know, enchanting in Skyrim is so much more readily available, and you don't have to worry about, like, weapons breaking, so you don't ever have to resort to a backup, right? So I feel like it's more rare that you would encounter a ghost unprepared in this game, right? Anyway, nonetheless, <laughs> happy Halloween, please. Uh, stay safe, you know? It's, uh, it's a wild one this, this year. <laughs> All right, until next time, like I said, please take care of each other.